What's going on YouTube? Gsna right here. So in today's video we're going to talk about the iOS 13.3.1 jailbreak and of course what we should expect in the future and also how you can jailbreak right now 13.3.1 on some devices. So as you probably know iOS 13.3.1 is currently the latest version available for iOS 13 devices and of course iOS 13.3 which had the latest uncovered jailbreak available for it is no longer signed and hasn't been signed for quite some time. Now if you want to jailbreak iOS 13.3.1 what exactly do you need? Well, as you probably know, we do use TFP0 kernel exploits for the uncover and other jailbreaks to be updated. However, there is also the check range jailbreak. Now, as you probably know, the last TFP0 kernel exploit was this one here by Jake James, which works for iOS 13.0 up to 13.3. So obviously, this isn't exactly very useful for 13.3.1. And in this case, if we want to actually update the uncovered jailbreak for 13.3.1, we would need another TFP0 kernel exploit like this one in here, which is based on OB timestamp and of course a new vulnerability. Now the exploit is based on a vulnerability so we don't need two separate things, we just need one exploited vulnerability of the type that the Google Project Zero releases usually. Now for those of you however who do have an iPhone 10 or lower, there is already an iOS 13.3.1 jailbreak and I'm talking about the check rain in here. Yes, the check rain jailbreak does support iOS 13.3.1 which is currently the latest version available as you can see from here but yeah this does support it and the reason it does support supported and the uncovered doesn't is because the uncovered uses a TFP0 kernel exploit like this one in here and the check rain uses a secure room or a boot room exploit. The difference is that the TFP0 kernel exploit can be patched in a new version but the secure room or the boot room exploit cannot. Now the disadvantage in here is that the check rain jailbreak due to the exploit is actually a semi tethered jailbreak which means that you do need to connect a computer every single time you reboot your phone if you want to jailbreak again. Now the phone would start normal without a jailbreak and of course without a computer but if you want to jailbreak again and re-enable your tweaks and stuff like that with the check rain jailbreak you do need a computer and the application which basically looks like this one here you plug in your device press start in there and follow the instructions but you do need a computer and it does support Mac OS and Linux but yeah you can jailbreak iOS 13.3.1 at this moment and of course the check rain supports the iPhone 10 iPhone 8 8 plus 7 7 plus 6 6s and of course the uh, iPhone 5 and the iPhone SE and of course many many iPads. There is however a problem, it doesn't support any of the newer devices like the iPhone 11 Pro, 11, 11 Pro Max, iPhone XR, XS Max and of course the XS. So basically no support for the latest devices in here. So in that case if you do have an iPhone XS, XS Max, XR or an iPhone 11 or 11 Pro or an iPad with the A12 or A13 chip, unfortunately you cannot jailbreak 13.3.1 with the check rain and you will have to wait for the uncovered jailbreak to be updated but that won't happen until we get a TFP0 kernel exploit which we currently do not have. The last one we have is for 13.3. However, if you do have an iPhone 10 or 8 plus or lower, you can jailbreak 13.3.1 right now and of course in order to do that you can either get the macOS version if you have a Mac or if you have a Linux machine you can get the Linux one. Now if you're new to Linux and you don't know how to install it or whatever, I definitely recommend you the uh, Ubuntu which is actually quite easy to install and of course it also runs from a USB flash drive which is of course perfect because this means that you don't have to replace your windows with it. You can just use it on demand. Now that's basically it. Thank you for watching. Check out the Jailbreak Central forum in here where you can ask jailbreak questions and of course follow the latest jailbreak news. Thank you for watching. I am Geosnow and till next time, peace out.